Tuesday night obviously wasn't the night for Hertfordshire-based teams. With league leaders Barnet losing, close neighbours Stevenage would go the same way. Borough could have pushed up to second with a win over Morecambe. Instead, they slipped up and it's seen them drop one place to eighth. Simon Weatherstone and George Boyd returned as Dino Marmria and Mickey Warner made way for the home side. Stevenage in their familiar white shirts and red shorts were attacking the goal to our left. Danny Bullman with a fairly presentable opportunity on nine minutes, but he managed to put it over the bar. Now, when is a wall not a wall? When Stevenage have given away a free kick, Kieran Walmsley's free kick trickled in from 35 yards out, untouched by anybody. Not surprisingly, the Shrimps wanted to hold on to their single goal that they created. They are proving difficult to break down. Darren stamped with this rare header, it went wide right. Well into the second half and it was stamped again with a header, this time coming slightly closer as he hit the woodwork. It was proving a painful evening for Stevenage, the chances few and far between. was almost becoming the Darren Stamp show though for Stevenage and again another missed header, this time from a Danny Bullman corner. Anthony Elding scored a hatful for Stevenage this season but sometimes it just isn't going to be your night. Five minutes from time, his spectacular volley well over the bar. But it wasn't all down to the home side. On the counter-attack, Morecambe looked bright and they could so easily have made it 2-0. Michael Twist with the run and shot. He seemed to press the panic button right at the most important moment. In his programme notes ahead of this game, Phil Wallace, the chairman, had said that Stevenage would have their ups and downs this season. This was definitely a down, particularly for Jason Goodliffe with this effort. Five minutes of injury time played in this game and Morecambe could so easily have made it two on the stroke of full time. Thankfully the keeper came to the rescue but it was still defeat for Stevenage as they went down at Broadhall Way by one goal to nil. <laughs> 